Oh man, I just love that lure. Every chance I get, I try and show it off. Let me show you again. Bounty hunter all day. This thing is amazing. Look at that. That turbo buzz is on point, man. You are the man. So, I wanted to do a video to talk to you today about three quick tips when you are fishing the bank for bass. Uh, for all you new anglers, anytime you're fishing from land, uh, it can be tough. It can be real tough in comparison to a boat and stuff like that. So. Sorry the video cut out on me on there. Just bad angle and poor lighting, I suppose. But anyways, I wanted to bring you three quick tips for bank fishing. Here we go, you ready? Number one, clothing. I don't wear camo and black just to play the part. These bass, when you get close, they can see everything. Red hats, red shirts, everything. So you wanna make sure that you're wearing the proper clothing when you're doing bank fishing. Black, camo, anything, and you wanna be quiet. You wanna be very quiet because the bass can hear you as well. I'm just being loud for this video, but you wanna be very, very quiet, okay? That's number one. Number two, you wanna be careful with the angles that you're fishing. You never wanna fish where you're standing. What I mean by that is you don't wanna ever cast straight out. You always wanna play it at an angle. So any little alcoves that you see, any little uh, areas that you're working, try and fish at an angle. Here's why. You can always drag your lure past where those bass are at. You don't want to put your lure right where they're at because you're going to scare them away, right? So try and cast past the spot you're working at an angle and drag your lure past that area. I always try and stay no more than 45 to 50 degrees from the bank that I'm standing versus where I'm putting my lure. So definitely consider the angles and work the areas past the bass first and then drag your lures in front of them so it's very conspicuous it's not as obvious number three whenever i am fishing whenever ever 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 especially in the morning i don't go anywhere without my cowboy coffee chew okay it's backwards in my angle but cowboy coffee chew now what this is is it is coffee in a can it's that simple it is one cup and one pinch it'll help you out with any sort of uh, nicotine or tobacco kick you're trying to get over anything like that at all so definitely check out cowboy coffee chew the link will be in the description check them out on twitter they have pouches you can sprinkle this stuff on food it is 100 percent safe to eat sometimes i put it on my ice cream because it's just that good it is honey sugar and coffee and it's going to give you everything you need to tackle your morning so i want to do this quick video three quick tips for bank fishing best of luck remember fishing spot reviewed fishing spot always approved it's piney z tallahassee checking out see you next time